So we have a lot of clients asking us, you know, do you have a showroom? Can I see the facility? I want to see the prints, the presses, how it work. So I thought it'd be really cool to do something, you know, like a tour. Very yeah. short, sweet, and just kind of show them, you know, what makes Culture Studio Culture Studio and how our processes aren't the mom and pops of the world in printing and in vendor. Yeah, totally. I mean, we we love to have our clients come here and see the space. I mean, it really kind of puts it in perspective on um, you know how much work it goes into actually making that product. Most people just think that you know the the garments just show up from China and um, exactly. you know and then that, that's how they're made. So you know, we we encourage our clients to come here down to Culture Studio and to engage with our creative team, see the space, tour the factory. And really, you know, get the full perspective on, you know, all that goes into making these amazing products and you know, just kind of how the production and the creative all flow in together and make something great. Um, actually, why don't, why don't we just do a tour right now? Let's, let's show do everybody. It. I'm oh. down. Yeah, let's start here with the brand coordinator team. This is really the heartbeat of what we do. These VCs and the rest of the team are, are reaching out to engage with each one of our clients in a, a very unique hybrid way. Instead of just kind of being account managers, they're really immersing themselves into the brand, understanding what they're needing, and they're that nucleus between what's going on in production and what's going on you know, in the client's world that we know can be truly chaotic. Uh, and we have our Could You Imagine wall up there as well. You can get a peek into that. Those are all big ideas that we're trying to push the team to rip off the wall. Hi. Hi. <laughs> You're on video. So as we move around, we have some really cool artwork. This is all products that, that we have made, put into a frame, call them art. We have a great homage to Winterland that is kind of our spin in saying that we recognize all the hard work and effort that went into for Winterland to build the factory that they built, and this is our cheers kind of to them. Our finance team here is here. Your video, guys. <laughs> then we have a wall of fame. These are all products that we may have made or printed that you can find out on the road on tour or inside your favorite retail store. Moving around, this is our creative team. Everybody can say hey. Hey, everybody. This team's working hard to realize the vision of the client sometimes maybe not even their actual vision once we understand and download what they're looking for um justin jamie and uh, annika and julie can then uh, remake their vision to something so much greater here's our dark room this is where we're exposing and making all of the screens and stencils. Tyler and his team are spitting out screens like crazy out here. Yeah, say hi. <laughs> Ripping them out. Ripping them out. We're at almost 20,000 total on these two machines. Awesome. <laughs> this is our washout booth. Of course, it's not the prettiest place to look. But reclaiming screens is a big part of what we do. And we do it in a very eco-friendly way. A machine like this is circulating and recycling water. It's recycling chemicals and recycling the ink back around so we're as eco-friendly as we possibly can be and still produce a great screen. You get a good long shot into the production floor. Okay. All of the equipment that we use is brand new. 
It has a little ink on it. We try to keep them clean, but everything here that we have is state of the art. All automated machinery. We try to give our team the best possible tools to produce the best possible product. As we continue down, we have machinery for every size order. We have machines that can handle very large quantities. And then as we continue to move around, we have smaller machines. Some of these machines do samples, lower runs, smaller quantities. But ultimately, we have some type of capability for any size order. We can do all the way down to one piece and all the way up to hundreds of thousands of these. This is our ink mixing station where we mix pretty much all of our ink completely from scratch. Our techs here go through a, a rigorous CS training in order to make this ink consistently the same way every single time. One of my favorite areas here at CS is R&D and sampling. We use this area to both sample, to send out to our clients or to their license holders or management to ensure that that product is going to be exactly the way that they want it done every single time. We do have automated sampling so we can get the exact pressure and squeegee and so forth on the sample press that we would on the autos. Spinning around here to embroidery. Some specialties that we do here with woven tags and labels um, and any, any type of sewing can be done on this machine. As we spin around, we're going to move into our fulfillment department. This team here works to ensure that the product is labeled correctly, folded, poly, hang tag, um, and any other retail driven service. All of these products are folded, automated, bagged, and packaged to go directly into big box retailers. Hey, boy. Moving back around, we go into our scheduling boards, shipping, our incoming docks that kind of move flow this way. So ultimately, everything flows in the building and right back out. Well, thank you for doing the tour with us and I uh, hope you enjoyed it.